that, listen, please, okay, please. Listen. You can learn more about God mm -hmm. as time goes on. Uh -huh. Later prophets know more about the person of God than uh -huh. earlier prophets. Muhammad, for example, might have known more about Allah than Ibrahim did. No. How, how, how so? Why not? No. How so? No. Explain it. Explain it. Do you know the difference? What you, the way you're explaining yeah. the difference, the difference is, I'm asking simple questions. All prophets of the Bible yes. or Christians, who understands God better than anyone else? Sorry, what? Who understands about God, Christians or prophets? Okay, okay. I just told, answer. Just answer. I told you this. No, before. I want you to answer this we question. We believe in progressive revelation. Did I ask you what you believe? Listen to me, please. So, because we believe in progressive revelation, right? Yeah. We Christians uh -huh. have a fuller understanding of the person of God than the prophets of the Old Testament, because these uh, things were uh, revealed uh, to them at, at that time. That's uh, all. Now, until now, you're not answering my questions. Suraj. Me now, if you ask me, as a Muslim, Suraj, what, no, no. what, what, what I say? No, what no, I say? no, no, no. You're not answering my question. I questions. did. No, you didn't answer. What I say? Now, if you ask me who knows about God better than anyone else, straightforward, my answer would be all prophets know about God, know, know, so about, know God more, better than anyone else. So who knew more about so God? So now, asking who you the same more question. About God, Muhammad or, or Ibrahim? No, because no, I'm forget, asking. Muhammad knows, right, that, 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 that God sent down the Torah, the Zabor, the Injil. But Abraham, Abraham didn't, didn't know these things, no. right? Listen. So Muhammad knows more no, because no. he has seen That's more revelations. That's about sending the books. But yeah, I'm talking but, about the nature of so, God. Okay, did, did Ibrahim no, I'm know, talking about the nature of God. Did Ibrahim know that God would communicate with man using books? Listen. He didn't know that. Abraham had a book. What, 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 what was, book? In, in Quran, he was what given book? a book. Abraham was What's given a book. In the Quran, it said Sohofi Ibrahim. That's the name. He was given to who? Yeah, in, in Prophet Abraham. Can you bring that up, please? Yes, in chapter. B bring it up, bring it up. Yeah. But it, it, even at that, he didn't know that God was going to send more books. You're not getting to the point. Sending the books and the nature of God is different. We can discuss about other things, the books and whatever, prophets or whatever. Yeah, you can tell me, Prophet Moses never knew about other prophets that who are going to, who, those who were, who came after him. He never knew that one. I would agree with you. But about the, the nature of God is different understanding than the way you understand when I compare to the prophets. Did, did Muhammad now, know any, sorry, sorry, did, did Ibrahim know anything shall about Shall I give the, you the verse first? Go ahead. Yeah. Well, while you're doing it, Ibrahim didn't yeah. know anything about It's out. chapter 87. You go, you, do you want to go there? Uh, chapter 87. Ibrahim, for example, didn't really know the description of, of heaven and hell. Chapter but Muhammad 87. Did. Chapter 87. Yep. 87 what? Chapter 87. Yeah. Verse... Uh, the last verses. Okay. Let's go anyways. Um, 19, so 19 verses. The last two verses. The last two verses say, Yeah. Even though the hereafter is... Uh, uh, Just so, Karen. From uh, this is certainly mentioned in the earlier scripture. The scriptures of Abraham and Thank Moses. You. See? Right. But is it saying that, that there's a scripture given to both Abraham and Moses? Yes. Is there ever seen the Torah? No. Or something else? No. So Torah okay. is for Moses. Oh, no. And Abraham was given another scripture. What was it called? No, Allah never told us the name. But it's called the scriptures of Abraham. So now? Okay. So my point still stands. Uh -huh. well, because point? even you believe in progressive revelation, the longer... Not about we God. Get away, no. No, still about God. Do not compare about okay, the books okay. and about God. Prove to me. Okay. Prove to me that Abraham knew everything to know about God. Prove okay. to me. So now I'm asking, do you believe... Jesus the man, let's say, according to your Christians believe, you believe God revealed his full nature when Jesus started his ministry, yes? Let's say. Okay, after let's say. After the resurrection. Oh, just after the resurrection. Yes, because, so, it, we, we, it, when we read Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, we see that after the revelation, that yes. is when the disciples came to the full understanding of who he was. So, because, wait, wait, okay. wait. Okay. As you go through his ministry in yeah. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, yeah. you will see that initially the disciples weren't sure who he was. 
Okay. At, at first, they, they will say, okay, we see a prophet. So, and that was Elijah. after the resurrection, the yes? Yeah, so when the resurrection happened... I got a question and, from and, that. And then they, they saw him, they saw his body. Why? Why? Yeah. Huh? Why? It's, 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 it's okay, I'll, 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 I'll come out to this, I'll come out to this. Uh -huh. <laughs> Let me come out to it, right? But when he was resurrected, and then they saw his body, uh -huh. right? The body that had the wounds in the hands and the wound on the side, and they touched it. That's when they realized fully that he was God. And that's why you have Thomas so, saying, my Lord and my so God. Basically, and Jesus says, now you believe. So basically you're saying, before the resurrection, yes. the disciples never knew that Jesus was a God. They had the fullest revelation of him after the no, resurrection. So is yes. that what you believe? Is that they, what you're they, saying? They suspected that he might be the Christ, the Messiah, the Son of God. No, Christ does after. not mean to be God. But so are you saying the Afterwards. disciples... No, just ask. Yes. Just answer, please. So are you saying yes, the disciples never knew that Jesus was God until after the resurrection. They came into the full understanding that he was God for the resurrection. Yes, that's right. After the resurrection. Okay, so now you're saying the resurrection, yes. we find out in the Gospels that they, some they people, he was a, a, after Messiah, he started his ministry, Christ, no, the prophet, okay, the rabbi, yeah. so not as God. Huh? No, as God. Some, Before the resurrection. So, some people are... are so, no, I'm talking they, about his disciples. Yeah, so, the disciples, yes. Yeah, they, they came to Fusatani afterwards, yes. So, before then, they, they, and, and in the Bible it says, and when, according to, uh, do you know, when Jesus was, tra was traveling with his disciples, and he was sleeping, according to the Bible. On the boat? In John, yeah, on yeah. the boat. It says they worshipped him. So, are you telling me, at that time, it was before the resurrection, and are you saying they worshipped Jesus, but they never knew if Jesus was God? Yes, so effectively, the, what are you the, saying? Okay, so, the, so how no, can they worship him? Good question, good question, good question. Okay, how so, can they worship what, him what happened in that story, if they never knew well, that there he was, was God storm, until right? after and the Jesus resurrection? Was sleeping. And then they were scared, so they woke Jesus up and he calmed the storm. Okay, mm -hmm. which is actually a callback to the Psalms where it's said of God that God can calm storms. Okay, so that, that, that's like another like, like, um, uh, revelation of like, like being met in Jesus, right? Now, they worshipped him, yes, okay. However, but they believed him. You said they never believed him however, as God. However, however, the word in the Greek used, right, is a word that can also mean revere. So it's not okay? worship, basically. So were they worshiping him as God in that instance? I am not entirely sure. I don't think they okay. were. However, at the at the end, when when okay. he when he predicted his death three times and resurrected, and they saw him, then they understood fully who he was. And how? Okay. So now you say it basically. Yes. Jesus, the disciples of Jesus, basically, yes. they came to know the divinity of Jesus after his resurrection. Yes. yes. Before his the resurrection, yeah. they never worshipped him as God. He, as God. No. Okay, no. Thank you. Okay, so that means Jesus, in the beginning, after he started his ministry, he was not God. Until no, the resurrection. Not, okay, okay, okay. So that's not what that means. No, according to his disciples. That's, that's what, what I mean. That means. No, according they to his realize disciples. Realize. Realize. So, you, so you basically, you, you said okay. he wasn't and he became God. Okay, so now point. I'm asking. They didn't realize. Okay, when did Jesus claim, whoever seen me, who has seen me, has seen the Father? Was that after the resurrection or before the resurrection? Before the resurrection. Before resurrection before, okay. Yes. So are you but telling me, that, what, what's yes. your understanding about okay. that verse? So. It says No, in, according to you, what's your understanding yeah, so, about that? Uh, it says in, I can bring it up for you in a second, right? But no, the, I want you to tell me. Okay. There is a verse that says that uh -huh. Jesus is the physical form of the invisible God. Okay? What so, did I ask you now? Huh? Do you know what I asked you? You asked me what, what does it mean to say when, when Jesus says, if you see me, you see the Father. Yes. What that means and is was the that Father, before the resurrection before, or after? Before. Okay. The Father if that was is the invisible Okay? And Jesus Christ... So this is what, what I said in, in the burning bush. That was Jesus. Whenever you have a theophany, right? Uh -huh. a, a, a experience where you uh, physically see God anywhere in the Old Testament. What's happening there is that you're actually seeing the same as the Son. He's appearing to us in physical form, but the Father never appears to us in physical form. He's the invisible God. And it says that, that Jesus is the visible form of the invisible God. Now I'm saying... I, I'll bring up for you as well. So now I'm saying, basically, what you said is, yep. I'll just repeat. Go ahead. You said the disciples never realized yep, that fully. Jesus was God before and before the resurrection. But in John, we find out where Jesus said, if you have seen me, you have seen the Father. According to you, that verse, Jesus is claiming divinity. Do you agree Absolutely, with me? Absolutely, yes. Okay, thank you. So now, that was before the resurrection. Are you telling me you understand? Wait, wait. No. There you go. Wait, wait. Okay. I'm coming to That's my fine. point. No 
So now you're telling me mm -hmm. you understood what it means. Yes. The verse Jesus, where Jesus said, yeah. "If you have seen me, you have seen the Father," yep. and that was before the crucif uh, yes. before the crucifixion, yep. and before Jesus was resurrected. Yep. So that verse Jesus, you said he's claiming divinity. Yes. So are you telling me the disciples never understood where Jesus, when Jesus said, "If you have seen me, you have seen the Father." Okay. So are you telling me the disciples of Jesus, according to that verse, never believed Jesus was God? Okay. But according to your so, understanding, yep. you believe. According to that verse, Jesus was God. Yes. But according to his disciples, yes. they never realized okay. Jesus to be well, God. So he claimed, if you have seen, if you have seen, seen me, you have seen, seen the, the Father. Father. Yes. yes. Okay. Okay. So, I, as a Christian, okay. so have now, the luxury of, of, of reading so the entire understands? narrative okay. and seeing an entire narrative from the beginning to the end. In that time when that was told to them, they didn't have the luxury that I have of being able to read all the Gospels. They were still in person, in temporal time, with Jesus. At the time it was said, I cannot say for certain that they had a full understanding of what it meant, but that was realized to them after the resurrection. Okay, so now, the person who basically wrote is John. Uh -huh. So now, who understands God about Jesus, you or John? So I have no, a, just answer please. I do. You understand yes. better than them. Huh? Because I have a so, luxury. So you know better than the disciples of Jesus I, about I, him. I, I know better than them, but I know more about, about the person of Christ because I have than the luxury. His disciples. Well they, they knew him in a more intimate way than, 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 than I, I do. But I, my goal is, is to uh, form that same kind of intimacy that so, they had with Christ what? through my relationship with them. But in terms of knowing about Christ and knowing all the references that we have about Christ in, in a, a, a one cohesive book, yeah. I have that luxury, but they did not have it. They had the direct experience with, with God, which is valuable in its own way. So but, they, but I have a, a full of Christ. They, do you believe they, they had the Holy Spirit? Absolutely, yes. They received okay, it. Same as you. Be, be, before, before you go off of that, before you go off of that, let, let's, let's. No, no, I'm asking. Before you go off of that. So, what I don't understand this, right? is. So, one second, one second. So, okay. but, but what I was saying before about if you see, if you see me, you see the Father. Colossians 1.15 says, The Son is the image of the That's invisible Paul, God Paul saying, and okay. the first God, so the firstborn of all creation. That's so Paul saying. So effectively, like I, like I was telling you before, when you see Jesus, you see the Father, and that the Father is invisible. So Raj uh, once quoted that the Father st stays in inapproachable light. But whenever you see a physical manifestation of God, that's Jesus. Okay. So do you believe is God the Father human? Huh? Is God the Father human? No. Okay, is Jesus human? So Jesus wait, now. Wait, wait, please wait. I'm going Jesus, to your Bible. Jesus now. No, I'm I'm going. So because first of, of all, now you claimed you know you understood better. You understood about Jesus better than his disciples because you say because of the writings that, that, that they left. Yes. No, John, you understand more than John about Jesus now. Because well, John is the one John who said, Jesus said, if you have seen me, you have seen Father. John, in the Gospel of John, yes. again, chapter 5, verse 37. Mm -hmm. Just having that for you? John himself said, Jesus said, uh -huh. you have not heard God's voice, nor seen his form. Yes. yes Which yes. means... According to this verse, that's what seeing this Jesus verse is not the same as seeing God the no, Father. No, that's not correct. No, that's, that's correct. what Jesus that's said, not, not me saying. That is not correct, okay? okay. You read that completely so 